Good morning. I'm Barry Stevens. I'm with the uh, Town of Wake Forest Greenways Advisory uh, Board. This is Corey Reeder from uh, the seminary, and we're out here working on the trail that is going to connect Wakefield, Wake Forest Rollsville High School with the uh, Joiner Park. Well, as you said, I'm Corey Reeder, and I'm here representing the Southeastern Outdoor Club, and we're just now getting started, a uh, brand new club this semester, and we wanted to be a part of a couple service projects as well. So we had a couple guys out this morning helping Barry, and uh, basically we've been tearing up some ground here and clearing out a nice path, and um, we're excited to be able to give back a little bit to the town. Uh, my wife and I uh, enjoy Jorner Park tremendously, and um, the, the guys at the Outdoor Club as well are excited to be able to give a little bit back to the town of Wake Forest, and so that's what brought me out this morning, and we're excited about it. The, the project has uh, been broken down into several segments. Initially, um, Matthew Brown, who is a student at Wake Forest Rollsville High School and also uh, a, a Boy Scout, uh, created as an Eagle Scout project a trail that goes from the far tennis courts at the end of Juniper Avenue down um, underneath the power lines and through a site determined by the Town of Wake Forest Engineering Department as a, as a location for a bridge. And he also then built the uh, trail from the Greenway Network in the park down to the bridge site on, on the other side of the creek, of Richland Creek. So um, when the bridge goes in, you'll be able to get from uh, the high school across the creek and up into the uh, Joiner Park. In the meantime, uh, we wanted a way to utilize the trail that had been built by Matthew Brown, and so we've built a trail that connects from near the bridge in Joiner Park to this affordable crossing that the ATVs have created through use over the years. The town drops some stepping stones into the creek so you can walk across the creek feet dry, and so we wanted to get from that crossing, which is right here, down to the bridge site with another single track, another soft trail. And so that's what Corey and I are doing here today, is uh, building the trail that goes from the affordable crossing site down to the bridge site, which is about um, 125 yards uh, south of here. Uh, we're paralleling this uh, sewer line easement, but we're building the trail in the woods because that's more aesthetically pleasing.